realized today that the only thing I'm really interested in manifesting is being a tech mom. Like, I don't want to be at home all day, every day, cooking and cleaning. I'm already doing that shit, and I'm single, so I don't want to do it as a wife. I want to be a kept mom. I want to be able to get up whenever I want to get up and um, have somebody else come and clean and somebody else come and cook dinner. Cook dinner when I want to cook dinner. Or have my husband cook dinner, you know? I don't want to have to do it. I don't want to have to do that. The everyday, day-to-day -day chores, that is not the life that I desire to live every single day. I want to be cut, a cut mother, with my homestead, on my, my farm, that's what I manifest. So let's just get this straight. She wants to get up whenever she wants to get up. She doesn't want to clean, she doesn't want to cook, she doesn't want to be a mother to even her own children. She wants to just lay about and have a man do it all for her. Apparently, being a housewife and being a kept wife or a kept mum, as she puts it, is two different things. Sadly, modern females, they're so lazy-minded, they don't understand it's two of the same one. Because the wife that does get the luxury to have help, she does do all the things that you don't want to do. Just because it's a cook, just because it's a cleaner, doesn't mean she gets up whenever she wants to. Doesn't mean she doesn't clean doesn't mean she isn't raising her children doesn't mean she has the whole day to herself that doesn't take away any of that so the fact that you think a man is going to give you that so you can do nothing is absurd and quite frankly stupid you're very stupid to think that to think any man is going to find this attractive any man is going to put a ring around your finger. On top of that, you're a single mom. And this is how you are already thinking. So you just want a man to be not only a man, but a woman in your life too. So who are you then? What's the point of even getting into any relationship with you? What's the point even getting to know you? when you don't even want to do nothing. I feel sorry for that child that you have because quite frankly, you barely do the bare minimum even for her. You're probably the laziest single mother, excuse me, single mom I've ever witnessed. What's the problem with dating as single moms? I, I don't understand the issue with these men. We're talking men in their late 30s, like 38, 39, and as soon as you mention you've got children, they don't want to fucking know. And I, I don't get it. And then they go simping over 21-year-olds, and that's because they've got no responsibility. The free-spirited to get to do whatever the hell they want, and it makes them look good and feel better about themselves. There is nothing wrong with dating a single mother. Like, my kids are practically teenagers, well, my daughter is, she's nearly 16. My son's nearly 11. If anything, I've got more free time now opposed to what I had four years ago. This whole stigma of like dating someone with kids has really, really got to stop. Like it, it, it's wrong. It really is wrong. Like what's wrong with me? I'm 33 years old. I know what I want. I'm responsible. I do a pretty good job raising my children on my own. I've been single four years. What's the problem? Men in their 30s don't want single moms. And this is something you need to accept in your reality. And there's nothing you can do about it to change that. Because you can't blame a single man in his 30s wanting a 21 year old. That's not simping. It's very natural. That's how you became a single mom. So, don't get upset that those 21 year olds didn't mess up the same way you did. Don't get upset they have free time. They're free spirited. They don't have a child to look after and no man around to help them. You decided to waste your prime years making poor decisions and sleeping with men who don't really matter to you. 
That's your fault. You can't pin that on a man. There's nothing wrong with his preference. There's nothing wrong with how he views you. Because initially you did fail. Being a single mom is not a prize. Being a single mom doesn't make you strong. Being a single mom doesn't make you more beautiful. It actually reveals so much of the lacking you have as a woman your red flags and how unsubmissive you really are now those are all the things a man doesn't want and those are all the things that made you be in that situation you submitted to lust and now you're here with a child what's crazy is you as a single mum don't have free time and you will never have free time until your children are successful because you should be fully committed and passionate to make sure that you are pouring your everything to your children especially in a single parent household because you already know they don't have everything they need so you need to put in even more for them so when you say you have free time a man sees that and thinks wow so you're literally gonna pull your children back for your own pleasure that's quite repulsing because now you're gonna do that to his children no man wants that so all the things that you're saying you really think is adding to you it's actually doing the opposite you have not only become but you're making yourself less attractive to men stand up comedy with t so i asked my baby father for 10 pound yeah now it's been over 32 hours that i've been waiting for this money anyway so he said that he was gonna come drop it to me in greenwich i said that's not a problem like i'm here i'm waiting up for you innit then he says he's gonna transfer it now all of a sudden he's woken up in the girl's house like what did he expect me to say like oh you shouldn't be doing them things there because you're my baby father i told you damn straight i hope you got chlamydia <laughs> Where is my ten pounds? But it's all right though. It's all right because it's not like I'm catting for a Ben right now. Because if I was catting for a Ben, I'd be literally on my knees, bro. Like I need a zoo. I just want ten pound in my account so I can spend your money, so I don't have to spend mine. Do you get it? Like I'm down to thirty pound. Like that is my spa money allocated. Do you get it? But I've got four fifty on Clearpay. Woo! <laughs> Looks like I'm buying matching trainers for me, my daughter, and my son. <laughs> Don't do drugs, kids. Because this single mum right here, you are catting for a Benz. Benz is a green. So, you are catting for the Benz. You are on your knees. You look like the first thing you did when you woke up was have a zoo or scrapping the little money you apparently have or don't have for that zoo you are everything and more but a single mum who has failed not only those children but herself and what's funny is you will sit there laughing at that child's dad as if you ain't the same you and him are both the same you're both one there's no difference it's just really embarrassing to see this and what's embarrassing is she wasn't even embarrassed enough to not post this she wasn't even not embarrassed enough to not even put some clothes on your stomach is hanging out your shirt listen it's funny but it's not funny because she is a whole mess and right now she is on literally the urge of losing all the screws that are already lost in her head she's off the rails and at this point no one can help her so we have single moms who don't want to do nothing don't want to be judged for being a single mom and also just want to get high i mean 
how do you expect for any man to want to take you serious? It was those mindset what got you there in the first place. So, let me know what you think. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Bye.